Hello friends, welcome to my another video. In this video, I'm going to talk about how you can use RK Hunter and CHK rootkit to detect rootkits in your Linux Mint system. You may ask what is rootkit? A rootkit is a program that takes the fundamental control of a system or in Linux term root access of your system without your permission by using known security flaws. Uh, neither CHK root nor RK Hunter fix anything but they inform you of a problem. So let's see how you can detect those rootkit using command line tool RK Hunter and CHK rootkit. So RK Hunter uh, it is also known as rootkit hunter scans files and system for known and unknown rootkits backdoors sniffers and malware let's see how to install this so just open the command line terminal and uh, just give this command sudo app get install rk hunter mm. hit enter give your password RK Hunter is now installed. Next, I'm going to use the RK Hunter to detect any rootkits. So, just uh, type here sudo RK Hunter, give option, check, hit enter. So, you can see it's checking system commands. Well, press enter to continue. It's checking for rootkits now. Enter to continue. It's performing additional rootkit checks. Checking the network, checking the local host, and uh, here you can see uh, there is two warning uh, in the file system checks. Uh, uh, there is not always need to panic. It only means RK Hunter has found any non-standard file as far as RK Hunter is concerned. So just uh, if you find such warning, you can just uh, manually check. Uh, hit enter to continue. Here's the uh, system check summary uh, total file properties check uh, file checked 132 suspect file 0 rootkit checks rootkit check 292 possible rootkit 0 so uh, all results have been written to the log file here to rkhunter.log so for more help on RK Hunter, you can Type this command RK Hunter and option H. So these are different options available here for RK Hunter. You can go through this. Uh, next, I'm going to install the CHK rootkit. This CHK rootkit is a shell script that checks systems binaries for rootkit modification. So to install this, type this command sudo app get install chk root kit hit enter so uh, next to perform action with chk root kit you just have to simply type sudo chk root kit hit enter So CHK rootkit has completed its action so nothing to worry, uh, nothing found here. So none of these tools guarantee that uh, system is not compromised but still uh, it's better to give a try to these two tools. So that's all for now friend. I hope this video was helpful for you and uh, thanks for watching.